Hello, my cozy company, it's Rosalind, and welcome to a first look at Caravan Sandwich, a cozy exploration adventure game about a missing sibling. Very curious to see what this is like, especially because in the description for the game, it said there's no combat and no stress. So I'm curious what the story is going to be about. But, but before we jump into that, we always check our options. So let's see, game here. We've got some languages, climbing modes, camera modes, and mini maps. Oh yes, I love a fixed position mini map. I'm gonna go ahead and change that. And I love the automatic cameras and an automatic camera mode. Let's go ahead and try that out. On sound, we've got so many different sliders. My favorite accessibility feature is seeing these sliders so we can adjust what volumes might need to be adjusted. And then we can also change device type. The game's audio can be adjusted for optimal experience. Huh, you can even do mono and stereo settings. That's really cool. In video, we've got some FPS limits and graphics quality options for you to run the game a little better. And then we've got our controls here. Ooh, stick control. Ooh, or standard controller vibration. We can turn on and off. There's a camera sensitivity. We love that. And it looks like we can remap our controls as well. Oh, that's so great. And then they've got another menu here for accessibility and they've got an interface size. I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn this up. Can I turn it up? Ooh, 110. Accessibility radar. If activated, visual and sound indications will reveal nearby items when the accessibility radar is being used. I'm gonna turn that on. Motion sickness reduction. Field of view is widened, the camera is more stable and a central marker is added in order to reduce motion sickness. That's awesome. I hope that is helpful for some people. And then accessibility features, sound volume linked to accessibility friendly sounds. Oh, they help make it possible to recognize the type of action when our player interacts with something in game. Okay, and that's already turned all the way up. All right, cool beans. Let's go ahead and give it a try. I'm excited to see, ooh, we can do multiple games as well. Let's go ahead and start. I still can't believe it. I've just received a distress signal from my sister Garance's spaceship. The thing is, she disappeared more than six years ago. The distress signal seems to have come from our home planet, Siaglo. It's also where she was seen for the last time. Must go back there. It answers. Seems like our sister's been lost a long time, six years? Wow, okay. I'm assuming, is it Sage? Sausage? <laughs> I'm going to I'm going to call our character Sage. So it seems like we're on a spaceship. And we're returning to the planet we were born on. Quick, my train is on the other side of the space station. Oh, no touchy, it says. E. Yeah, this place is not really maintained. Anymore. Oh, push it. Oh, to open the door. Let's see, it's the Aglo space station. Oh, so we've already arrived at the space station for the planet. Looks like we just need to catch a train. Oh, need a ticket. I can't be bothered to pay. Nobody's even looking. This barrier's open and there's no one around to stop me. Uh, what do you mean it's open? It's clearly not open. Oh, a snack bar. A synthetic cereal bar. Ooh. It's my lucky day. Why? It's empty. Why is it your lucky day? Can I take this? Who could forget their bag here? Nobody ever comes to this station. Hmm. That's what we use to log into Toaster here. So retro? What's Toaster? I'm confused. Hey, I recognize this advert. It was already there when I left six years ago. Oh, so this has been pretty static. That's when Toaster first came out. Maybe it's a... Oh, it must be social media. We can't do without it now. Everyone uses it to keep in touch with each other. Hi. Welcome to Siaglo's space station. Or hi. Okay. Oh. Drat, there's the train. Oh. This dust is everywhere. Oops. Oh, need to climb as well. Jump and leap. Oh, we can do a little sprint as well. With shift. That was shift that I pressed, yes. Going, going going yes i'm almost there get on the train i'm on the train i need to speak with this guy hello hello rose bloody signal jammers does this old beater still fly train time oh 
Nefla? Sage, is that you? Uh, the one and only. Uh, I'm in a hurry. Are you taking the train? Straight up, you are Sage after all. Chill out. We still got a little time. Oh, okay. Well, what are you doing here? Didn't you go to school at the same time as my sister? I gave up. But anyway, have you also not been able to contact Siaglo? What do you mean? There's a signal jammer in the village. It's a piece of old consortium tech that cuts off all communications. People have given me a shopping list since we can't even order anything anymore. So everything's just been cut off? Even the distress signals? Ah, uh, there's the train's whistle. Drat the packages. Quick, help, help me get them in. Oh, off we go. Must be an automated space train system then. Oh, this is so gorgeous. Oh, time to land. Oh, wow. It looks pretty, uh, oh, there's a person. Looks pretty abandoned here. So if there's a signal jammer, how did we get a transmission about our sister? It's not really something to write home about, but I'll never get sick of the countryside. Okay, Nefla, I've done some thinking during the ride. I need to tell you something. Don't panic. Uh, okay, I hear you. I received a distress signal from Garantz. Uh, yeah, of course you did. That's impossible. I'm in her emergency contacts. Her spaceship is in a critical state. Garantz is dead. Or disappeared, and she doesn't want to be found. Anyway, that's the last thing I wanted to talk about. <sighs> I'm sorry, I know this means a lot to you. You don't understand. Nefla, you've got to help me. I cannot believe that she's still alive after all these years. This came from her spaceship, and if we can find it, we'll surely get some answers. I... What's that noise? That must be Rose. Let's see what's happening. Oh, another friend to reconnect with. Her, her name is Rose. Gotta go and see her. Oh, snack bar. Sugar! <laughs> it's not the taste I wanted, but okay. Hey, I mean, quick energy. Soda hasn't been sold since the consortium left 40 years ago. Oh, she really made a mess of herself. I jump? Oh, there's stairs over here. The last note on the board is from two years ago. It's sad. Everyone up and leaves because there's no more work. Sounds familiar. Oh dear, how did I get myself into this mess? Oh, hello! Oh dang, of course it had to fall on me. Hey Rose, is there a problem? may have gone off the road a little bit. Oh, but wait, is it really you, my darling sage? Uh, no, I'm a big green talking plant. Yeah, it's been a long time. Kind of you to come and see me before I become compost for my tomatoes. Come tell me about your adventures later. A little scared that the van will catch fire. Oh, no. Wow, you actually sounded like you meant it this time, Rose. I'm sorry, my reflexes aren't as sharp as they used to be. Don't worry, we'll fix it up in my garage. Nefla, thank you for being there for me. Although, uh, I still don't have a driver's license. Uh, well, it's a ship license. I've got a license, you know. Thank you, my darling Sage. Great. Off to the garage. Okay, so it's Rose's van. Oh, I wanted to do some more exploring. Can I get out? Okay, I guess I... Oh, I have notifications on Toaster. Emergency message. Alert. Mark is important. You are an emergency contact for Masco Garants. This automatic message has been sent from the network on the planet of Siaglo. The spaceship registered to Masco Garrett's is in critical state. Hmm. Basil, where are you? What's this note I found in your room? You're going back to Siaglo just like that? I'm calling Dad, and that's not going to happen, by the way. Do not get on that train. Oh? Oh, looks like we have a very large map to explore. How cool is that? Off we go. Siaglo Kalanique? Coves? It's gorgeous. Careful with your driving, Sage. My little van is already pretty dented. Sorry, uh, it says go faster. I don't know if I can control going faster. Don't worry, I'm in space pilot school. Yeah, show us what you got that- Uh, don't- don't challenge me. I'm scared to go faster. Estio Village? Estello Village. Small, quaint little place. Come on, Rose, let's take a look at this van. Being such a bother, aren't I? Relax, I like fixing up stuff. Let me take a look too. Nefla, come quick, get over here. Huh? 
Sage? Sage? Yucca? Everyone gather around. Sage is back. Kid, you're here. Saffron and Clementine. Sage, it's been so long. So happy. Hi. Let's not mess about. We need help here. Nefla, I took the signal jammer down to the square just like you asked. Even the Rientos are having problems with the signal jammers. Ooh, sounds like this is a big problem. What now? I don't have time. My little sage, could you please take care of it? The village folk really want to see you too. Ah, uh, sure, why not? Bab. Thank you, sweetheart. I'll find you shortly. Okay, so Nefla is going to work on the van with Rose. And we're going to go see Yucca. She's high up in the square. She was a friend of Garance's too. We get... I love the colors in this game. It does remind me of the same feeling that Dungeons of Hinterburg gives me as well. I feel very at peace. I have no desire to go fast. Oh. Oh, deactivate this area's jammer to regain access to the network. Oh, I see. Let's see. My friends are over here. Hey, Sage, over here. Hi. So happy to see you again. You came back to help us destroy this jammer? The connection is gone. Uh, I'll do my best. Been working on this for days, kid. You're not going to be the one to fix stuff. Go back to your space city. Nah, Saffron. Don't speak like that to Sage. But it's true, isn't it? Nephila's been searching for an answer forever. How could he manage instead? Because Sage is going to use my unjammer. Oh, Nephila, at last. I'm waiting for you for weeks. Yeah, quite a few delivery contracts. And what's that thing in my jig then? I hope I didn't move that signal jammer into the square for nothing. I built an electromagnetic forming transducer. Oh, okay. Which will enable electromagnetic waves to be created. In turn, they'll destroy the jammer from the inside thanks to an artificial ultra precise pulse which reverses polarity. Makes sense. It's just magnets. No, no, Sage. Go ahead. The honor is all yours. Uh, let's get started. Okay, so we've now got an unjammer, a device Nefla gave me that overloads the magnetic strips of jammers to deactivate them, or something like that. Pretty much. That's that's pretty much the gist of it. Break it. Ah, and part of our map is now open. Estello Village, and then we've got an area called Hydro Post with a couple of different points of interest in Rose's Retreat. Interesting. Well played, Sage. It's true that it's quicker than going to the desert to bury it. Finally, I'll be able to check my messages. All right, well, there are always other ones. Oh, someone watching us? Um, creepy. Very creepy. Well, kids, I'm back. Oh, so you miss Sage busting up the signal jammer with my unjammer. Well, that's great. Rust isn't going to go as smoothly. We need to smash up the remaining signal jammers. Should we deal with the signal first? I am so ready. What signal? That's what we'll do, but in order to do that, we have to break the jammers. No chance of finding the distress signal. Oh, 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 he, we meant the, our sister's signal. Okay, all right. Do you know where the others are? No, not exactly. However, I've come up with the plans for an antenna, which could detect them. Just what we needed. Let's go build it now. Hold your horses. I don't have enough recycled parts in the garage to build it just yet. Can I help you find some in that case? Yep, that would be perfect. I need to analyze the framework of the signal jammer that's been broken. And another thing, don't you know where my father went? He wasn't at the cafe. Ah, uh, yes, he went to look for the nomads in the desert. He didn't want to wait for me to come back to lend him the van. Still so stubborn. Well, just come see me in the garage when you've got a moment, Sage. Sage, sweetheart, can you drop me off at home with the van, please? Of course. No need to work. Walk all that way. Drive Rose home. Good to see you around here, honey. Say, you do look a lot like Garance, you know. Yeah, I'll be the same age that she was soon. I will never get over it. People really do make an impact on our lives. Oh, home sweet home. What a cute little place she's got. It's so good to be home. What a cute little place right by the water. Your house, it's absolutely gorgeous. So my darling Sage, I know you were talking about something important with Nefla, but what's all this I hear about a signal? 
I received a distress signal on Toaster. A what signal? I... What's wrong, sweetheart? I just don't know. I feel lost. I don't know what to do. I received a distress signal from Garen's spaceship. She disappeared six years ago on this planet. Where should I even look? The comms are all blocked? I can help you. And even if I had an inkling about what needs to be done, there's no way of traveling to the desert anyway. If I try to go on there on foot, I'm going to disappear like she did. Sage, listen to me. It's totally stupid to come back here. Why must I always rush blindly in without thinking? I am so fed up with this, I have no plan whatsoever. Sage, I am trying to talk to you. What? I don't know if you're going to find what you're looking for, but I am sure that you're capable of finding the signal source. You'll get there if you take my van, no doubt about that. But what if I wreck it? I don't want to hear it. Take these keys and go discover your planet. However, my van is the only vehicle that's still working around here. It's the last exploration van left by the consortium. I decided to keep it when the Tarask incident happened 40 years ago. As everyone left for other planets to pursue the Helios project, all the other vans became wrecks. So I'm relying on you to carry on helping the people on Siaglo. Yes, yes, I won't forget. Okay, sweetheart, come and have some tea. This tea really hit the spot. Sometimes good company and a little bit of a drink to slow down really does help refresh you. It's getting late. Would you like to sleep here? Yes, please. Oh, I bet that's a fantastic place to sleep. Here in the waves roll in. Ooh, chapter one, speed. It's been three days since we got the distress call. Time to travel to another planet. So now we've got a van. Wicked! Sleeping at Rose's house, it's so much quieter than in Space City. Now I need to find Nefla in their garage. They wanted to see me. Right, we need to help them gather some recycled parts. Seems like they're waiting for you in the village. They're probably planning for something for you. What do you mean? Go and see for yourself. I need to take a rest. The perfect place to take a rest. Oh my goodness. Right here by the shore. So nice. We. Oh, new message. F. Right, we can get messages now because we got rid of the jammer. Do you sleep well? Come meet me at the garage. Let's talk about the jammer and the coves. This one is indeed very bothersome. Oh, show on map. Oh, cool. So it shows where, where folks are and who has a quest and it's lit up in yellow. Cool. Very nice. R to get in our van. We do a little, we do a little backy backy. Here we go. And we take a look at our map. So there's the hydro plant that we saw earlier on the map. I'm so scared to go any faster. How do I get out? R? What's the screen thing? What are you? E. Common component. Standard components in which transistors, among other basic parts used in all kinds of devices, can be found. Okay, maybe that's one of the items that Nifla needs. Kind of just keep an eye out for things that we might be able to collect. I'm sure there's a lot that can be found on foot as well. Oh, looks like we're in an area that does not have a signal yet. We've got to get rid of the jammer. Uh, this is back to where we came into the planet. Hmm. Maybe we can check around on foot. Oh, some wild common mallow. It's edible, but I didn't like it when I was little. Oh, might as well take it. Meant to be medicinal, but it's more often used in salads. Probably a good thing for us to continue to collect then. A snack bar. Yikes. I hope it's still good. Ooh, we've got a little fire here. A friend? Hello? Um, hello? Oh, Curry, it's you. That depends. Who's asking? Oh, Sage. Happy to see you again, youngster. It's been years. I thought you disappeared in the storm. No, I was in Space City. I'm just going to keep my mouth shut. I'm not responsible for anything. Anyway, you're here now. Tell me. Are you busy? I have a way more important mission for you. Okay, well then. I can probably help. Need food. Why don't you go get it yourself? 
Too old to be running around. So you're telling me you're hungry. So my old pal Poivron is coming for a visit. Whenever the Nobads come, I prepare a feast for them, and I absolutely need... Oh my goodness. Wild common mallows for the appetizer. I'll make a salad, but I need something local, fresh, and colorful. Should be able to find some in the coves. Triangle sandwiches for the main dish. I'll make a sandwich cake called Smorgarstia. I think you'd find some in the ruins. That's about the only thing we eat back in the day. And synthetic cereal bars for the dessert. I'll use them to bake a cake. Find some in the nomad camps. You always leave some there in case a nomad gets lost and needs something to eat. No, it's a lot. I'll send you a recap on toaster. That does sound like a feast. Can I come? We'll see. You have to earn it first. <laughs> I think I would earn it if I'm providing all of the food. <laughs> okay. So we earned ourselves a little side quest. Ooh, a new object, an uncommon component. You can get coils, motors, and other valuable parts from this type of component. Okay, so I need to look out for red items as well. I really like how easy it is to platform in this game, how easy it is to get around. Things are just so climbable and it's really, really nice. Ooh, what's this? This symbol. Kind of freaky. Hmm. Reminds me of the person who's watching us. Can I... Ooh, I see red up here. Can I get another uncommon component? Oh! Maritime receiver. Turn it on. Oh, we got a ladder. Nice. Scarf with symbol. An orange scarf bearing a strange symbol. Oh, someone lost their scarf. It's really light. I guess it's protect oneself from the sun. Another common component for us. Lots to discover. Taking what I can because I do not know what Nephla will need. Time to climb. Ooh, there's another jammer here. I don't know if we'll be able to unjam immediately. Yes! Ooh, we can! That's lovely. So it seems like this person of interest is at the locations of the jammers. Are they leading us there or are they just observing us kind of tamper with the jammers. And who put the jammers there in the first place? That's the question. Ooh, new zone, coastal door. That looks like something I can dig up. Or if that's something we can do in this game. I see something green. Give me that component. Oh, okay. We got a fancy door here, friends. As far as doors go, this here is a tough cookie. Doesn't look like it's opening from this side. Gotcha. Maybe there's something of use up here? Yes, there sure is. Ooh, an uncommon, uncommon component from there too. Very nice. I really like that I do not have any stamina concerns. I can just jump and, and run to my heart's content and explore. And the music is just so nice in the background. So unobtrusive, but also calming at the same time. So, so nice. Another new zone, Hydro Post. I've just been running around. Exploring and collecting things. Oh, looks like we've got a little power node here. E. Oh! And a common component as well. We opened something. Oh, I might be getting ahead of myself. When I was young, I was small enough to squeeze between the bars of this. Oh, wow. Okay. Don't want to get too ahead of myself. We're gonna need some more technology to be able to help us with the jammer. So I'm gonna go back and grab our car and talk to Nefla. We have 17 common components and six uncommon. I wonder if that'll be enough to help. Howdy, howdy. Nefla, great news. Rose has lent me her van, so I'm gonna go set off in search of that signal. But I don't know where to start. Oh, that's great. She trusts you big time. Uh, I've been on the trail of these jammers for a while now. I've drawn up the designs for the tools to find them. You just need the necessary parts to build them yourself. The parts meaning you've already found some. These electronic parts are just lying around and broken devices, that kind of thing. I'm extracting the rail metals and the microcontrollers that I'm missing from them. Be careful, they don't all have the same value. 
Those components are only interesting for the transistors and their coils. However, some consortium devices contain rarer parts and metals. I think you can even find quantum crystals. In other words, I gather components, then you put everything into order and tinker with it? Yep, that's right. You'll have the details on Toaster anyway. When you brought in enough, I'll set aside some time for us to build the tool we need. Cool. Where can I find the parts? The village folk always have some old junk that you can recycle. Help folks out, then ask them if they have spare electronics in a drawer somewhere. Otherwise, you can probably find some in the ruins. When you have what you need, we can build an antenna to locate the jammers. I already started working on it, so I only need a few components to complete it. Speaking of which, I see that you've already smashed the coves when it's okay, but you're going to need tools quickly in the desert. Works for me. Looks like we have enough parts to build the antenna? All the plans for building the antenna. Nefla wrote, perfect for locating the signal jammers in no time. Okay, it will take several days for the tool to be made. Diaglo's residents will move on to do other things, and you will no longer be able to help them with their current tasks. Make sure you have completed everything you want to do in this chapter. Oh, okay, no one has tasks for you. It's possible that we could miss dialogue or side quests when we go to build a tool. That's something to keep in mind. Should, does that mean I could also be missing some collectibles? Mm, okay, make the tool. Go ahead and get it made. Looks like an antenna to me. Ooh, miss that nasty storm. Wonder if that's been a permanent feature. Chapter two, new routes. Days since the distress call. Seems like Curry said that the storm was has been here a while. Ah! Uh, with this antenna, I can pick up signals from far away and locate jammers. Right, well, we've done some good work. This antenna is awesome. Wait, first I want to see what it's like in the field. <laughs> I was hoping you'd say that. Allow me to present my receptacle. We're going to test this antenna inside it. Oh, you made this here? Let me show you. Ooh, fancy. <laughs> Nefla, where are you? Wait, it needs to calibrate. I wouldn't want to fry your brain straight away. Oh, boy. Oh, the receptacle. Like my driving simulations. I have this at school for practice. Uh, well, imagine it's normal. I borrowed the tree-like structure from the consortium reality simulations. Basically, it's not open source, but their model wasn't super well protected. They thought they'd just keep all this tech for themselves. I just added my own little personal touch and hey, presto. Wow, stylish. But what's the antenna for? Simple. You wire it up and the jammers start popping up. You can just as easily use it to scan for objects around you. Ooh, that's gonna be handy. Very handy for parts. While you're waiting, see if you can break the fake jammer in this example as a practice run. Ooh, equip your antenna to reveal the location of signal jammer. Jammer. Okay. Now you can go and jam it. Okay. So that was our scroll wheel that we used. And then we just climb up here where the signal is the strongest. I see. So he had like a whole bunch of fake ones. Destroyed. I'm ready for the next step. This time you'll have to scan. First, equip your antenna. Okay. Now use the antenna to scan. It'll reveal all the items close by. Okay. And that's with left click. Nice. Wonderful. Oh, component. Mark. Now find and collect all the hidden components. Gotcha. Got it. And we go back to the van. And do a little click and we look. Oh, I see one over here. Found it all. We can carry on. There's only one lever that can open the door. Mark the N466 with your antenna. Mark, okay. Four, six, six. Nice. Now get off and go activate to open the door. Okay. Cool. I love how that stays on screen. So nice. Very handy. Found the lever. The door should open now. It sure does. Time to exit. So, did the virtual reality run all right? I hadn't had time to stabilize everything yet, unfortunately. Uh, relax. I'm just feeling a bit nauseous. It'll pass. 
Okay, you've seen how it works. You can use the antenna to locate and smash every jammer on the planet. Yep, I'll do my best. Also going to help us figure out where the signal from Garance's spaceship is coming from. But you didn't want to talk about it. Finally have a way forward. I cannot stop now. Me neither. Listen up. We have to get rid of this interference in order to locate the signal. I spotted one in the desert close to the Labotech. You should be able to get to it. Why this one in particular? It should allow me to contact the aqueduct control room, which has a much bigger range. I'd tell you to destroy other ones as well if time hadn't welded those old doors to the ground. I already thought of a grapple hook to yank them free, but I'll need more components. I'll mark it on the map. Maybe I should wait until my father returns from the desert. I have to wait a long time, though. All that's left is to go into the desert when you're ready. Works for me. Ooh, Dad still isn't here. I might run into him when I go into the desert. So we've got a brand new antenna. And it looks like we have some side quests on our map. And plenty more to explore here in Caravan Sandwich. This is so interesting. And I love how calm this game is. I, I want to just explore and I want to destroy all these jammers, but I also want to take my time doing it. It also gives me this this vibe of Creatures of Ava that I was experiencing in that game as well. So I think this is one that you guys are really going to like. Hope you'll go check out Caravan Sandwich over on Steam. If you want to see more of this game in particular, make sure to leave me a comment below and we'll consider it for a possible long play in the future. Check out another adventure with me right here on the screen, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.